Assalamualaikum. Hi everyone. This is Mr. Rayman, ICT teacher running IGC in Sudan. In this video, I'm going to explain how to do the VLOOKUP. I have this example here. Exam pass paper October number 16. Question number 18 asks you to do VLOOKUP. Uh, examiner will never ever ask you which one you are going to use a VLOOKUP or a HLOOKUP. So I'm going to tell you how to choose which one you are going to use. And the question asks you to go to D6 and reuse the function. And take the function lookup from external final 16.3.lookup.csv. Now look at them for this report. Find the file here, first of all. This one is the, the file that we are going to use it for the table array. The table array now uh, sorted uh, as vertical lines. So we have the uh, we have columns, we have rows, and vertical lines. So that's why we are going to use VLOOKUP. Let's go now. Yes. In this file, you have to find the VLOOKUP the lookup value first. You have to write the VLOOKUP and then you have to find the uh, lookup value first. Uh, basically, the lookup value should be match with the other file. With the table array should be match something here and it should be match the first column. Uh, as example here, we have the G code and we have the first one as example here. And let's check the other one, which one we are going to use it to be as the lookup value. So here we have same things. Uh, we're going to start by equal v lookup up in bracket. You look up here we have you can just click on it and then use comma. Let's go to the other file. You can select the file, select from the corner to corner, select all of them. Because yes we select all of them. Now we have two files already selected. Comma. Now we need to decide what column we are going to use it to retrieve the values. Which column we are going to use it to retrieve the value? It's going to be column two. According to what? According to the selection that you make it, because. You did selection for uh, column A and B. So for the computer, he knows that he mentioned that A is column number one and B is the column number two. Let's go. Y2 here, comma, and then the match will be exact as it is. There is no fractions here, and there is no range. Uh, close the bracket and then enter. Now drag and drop. This we have the this is the VLOOKUP. Yes, somebody to remember something very important. VLOOKUP contains mainly main four points. Number one, the lookup value, number two, the table array, number three, the end call index, number four, the match. Number one, the lookup value that should be relative. The table array should be absolute. And then now two and then zero. Thank you very much. Uh, share the video, please. Share, share the video.